Fast Hoops on ESPN. Game day in the Granite State. Live inside Lund Home Gym in Durham, UMBC has made the trek from Baltimore to take on the New Hampshire Wildcats this weekend. Now it's Horvath's turn. How about the floater? Finger roll. Retrievers are fired up. They came on the court. They didn't play last week because of um, cancellation in the Stony Brook program. So they haven't played this calendar year, actually. And they were excited when they came on the floor for pregame warm-ups. So all the points, all eight on this 8-0 run to start are from inside the paint. There might have been a tenth of a second of doubt if that basketball was going to go in for Murphy. Owens off the catch, his second three. Wow, stop pass. Makes him a special player. Owens and one. He'll go to the line for a potential three-point play. He can shoot it, and this is my a beautiful play. You'll see him go right by McClure with the body, get the M1. When we chatted with Coach Odom yesterday, this year, excuse me, freshman player here in the conference. Yeah. Sky's in for the rebound. He wants to push in transition. He's a leaper. He jumped center when Horvath didn't play last week. Guadarrama backs down, and Surpri Owens pokes it out. Surprised it wasn't a foul on Owens that time. But. Lunia Sith denied, but Horvath cleans up his mess. Count the basket plus the foul. Okay. Spazievich with the rebound. Idle Rock the other way now for the Retrievers. He attacks Idle Rock to the right hand. He's always been so good. Jay Owens with three. Owens, yes! Wow. Pretty to watch was LJ Owens. Exclamation point on the first half for UMBC. Two of that back to back, the Houston Baptist transfer. Horvath in traffic, count the basket. He'll go for a traditional three point play. And the third foul on Nick Guadarrama, nightmare scenario. As we see Coach Harry hands on his head. Those are tough calls for the officials either way. Lunasith to the basket. Three for us this season. Granted, he's been hurt. Six for his first 11 on the year. Lochick wants a turn, and UNBC now leads by 20. In and, you know, front ends of one and ones, you miss them, it's like a turnover. There's shamanism for you. And answered right on the spot by Boone Yesser. Spazijevic swings it. Owens up to 17, a game high. UMBC, but swiped by Murphy. Up to Chiquenu. Rogers picks his pocket. That's what he does better than anybody in the country. Swiping. And Horvath. And setting up the three. 13. Discuss the times and what is on the minds of his players. Nice finish by Piccarelli, the freshman from Milan, Italy. Check it in one more time. That's it. UMBC handles the business in game one of the back to back and pulls in front of New Hampshire for second place in the America East standings. The Retrievers are now four and one.